Last year, President Putin made his first public appearance in a new Russian-made limousine, the Aris Senate. And Mr. Putin has been using it ever since, even when he travels abroad. The Aura Senate is a brand new Russian car that has been created within a very short time. Its history has only just begun, and yet customers are already lining up to buy it. Why would Russians need to make such an expensive car? After the USSR collapsed, Russia lost its position in executive class car production, as top public officials had to use foreign cars, which was perceived as a national disgrace. So in 2012, a task was set to make a car that could keep up with the Mercedes-Benzes, Bentleys, Rolls-Royces, and others. After just a brief five years, the Aorus was sent out on its journey. Although Porsche know-how was used in the project, as well as some foreign materials, its main parts, the engine and transmission, are made exclusively in Russia. There are more than 600 pre-orders for Aorus today, but its massive production run will be started in 2021. It is currently only being produced for Russian government needs, and you can see an Aorus in the streets of Moscow every day. The unarmored version starts at around $123,000, which makes it quite competitive on the international market. However, the car was made not only for the sake of profit. Thanks to the Aorus project, Russian engineers learned how to construct complicated cars all over again. They are now designing a minivan, an SUV, and a convertible based on the Aorus. The project also includes an electro motorcycle for the President's Security Service and a new engine for small aircrafts. Therefore, the Aorus is not just a toy for the rich, but a key to revitalizing an industry.